sunlight angle bust. Today we're doing today we're doing every flip I know how to do from easiest to hardest, starting with easiest. That being said, numero uno, the backflip. I had a solid warm up session. I feel good. How are you guys feeling today? Let me know in uh, you know I mean comment section. How you feeling? Numero uno. Shot. Second easiest flip for me to do would be side flip, not standing. Believe it or not, front flip is the third easiest flip for me, even though it was the first flip I ever learned. Front flip is third easiest for me. Don't pay attention to how it looks in this video because I haven't done a front flip. I haven't done a front flip in so long. But I'm gonna try my best. Front front flip is my third easiest. Fourth easiest flip, probably the frisbee. Even though I just learned it, I think fourth easiest and my favorite frisbee. What? The frisbee is my fourth easiest and my favorite trick to do. That's what I'm doing. I'm naming it Beyblade from now on. My fifth easiest flip, number five, is B-Twist. I love B-Twist. I need to do B-Twist more often, especially since I want to start tricking more often. Number five, B-Twist. Number six, standing full. For me right now, because I'm standing on a hill, I haven't done a standing full in a very long time. Standing full is number six. At number seven, we have the corkscrew. All right, I'm going to say this. Okay, I'm going to be straightforward and honest with you guys. I don't know what the fuck's going on with me. I don't know what's going on with my life. I don't know what I want to do. I'm only 23. Still got time to figure it out. But what I will say is that I am trying my absolute best. Okay, I just got back home to Virginia after living in Missouri for four years, something like that. Um, it was rough. It was rough, not gonna lie. It's still rough, so bear with me. I've been thinking about making another channel for gaming content because I've noticed that you guys love the IRL stuff a lot more, which makes sense because this channel is IRL stuff or was made to be IRL stuff, not gaming content. This is where this is very detrimental for me. And the reason why I have not been uploading, I don't know if I should make another channel or just keep everything on one one channel because uh, let's be real having two channels is very beneficial in very many ways but it's also very stressful in very many ways and with my life circumstances right now i don't think it would be smart for me to try and manage another channel even though it would be pretty straightforward i'd probably upload on that channel way more than i would upload on my iro channel because i'm always in my room on my computer or something i'm rambling I'm gonna keep everything on one channel simply because it's me it's who i am it's what i like this channel is for the purposes of me just having fun and sharing it with the world i'm not doing it for no money i'm not doing it for no fame i just i want to experience i want you to experience my life with me because you'll never know what it's like to be me and I'll never know what it's like to be you, which is why you should also do the same thing. I look like shit because I just, I don't care anymore. It sounds bad, but it's actually good because I used to care entirely too much. I would put on a front for you guys. I swear I would get dressed up every day trying to look good for the camera. And it just quickly became old and deteriorated my mental health, trying to impress people who I don't even know. Please don't say that out of heart. So I'm finally taking a leap out of my own body and I am doing this shit for me. I was trying to do it for y'all. I mean, I'm still doing it for y'all, but like I'm doing it for me. You feel me? Just like Yodi family, like full cream. He be doing that shit for him, but he also be doing it for y'all. Like he just, that's me. So don't be surprised if one day I'm outside doing flips and then the next day I'm outside, I'm inside playing COD. That's just, a, that's what this channel is gonna be. And if you don't like it, feel free to unsubscribe like half of you have already done. It does not hurt my feelings. Again, I'm doing this for me. I mean, 
that's it i'm trying to get over my depression and all that so i think this is very beneficial for me by actually taking this step because i ain't gonna lie to y'all it's been rough like it's when i tell you it's been rough simply just trying to figure out youtube itself oh man you guys don't understand but that's being said i did break my hand i broke my pinky boxers break i'm not gonna tell you how i broke my pinky if you know you know if you don't you don't but i broke my pinky so i don't know if i will be doing any parkour content myself but i might do some reaction to some parkour content i've been really digging ed scott's videos team fat fucking dom tomato i've been enjoying all those guys out there in the uk so i might just like react to some of their stuff and do that and i might go outside one of these days because it's starting to get really warm and train my legs and stuff without using my hands obviously but yeah that's the future for this channel that's the future for me i hope you guys do stick around and you know experience this this uh this life with me because it's been an interesting one already it's only been 23 years and i already felt like i've gone through a lifetime Ooh. but yeah i'm out thanks for uh taking the time to watch this very awkward video next up is probably gonna be a gaming video probably some mw2 snd because uh, i've been really digging mw2 and season drops tomorrow so yeah peace oh by the way follow me on kick kick.tv kick description kick yeah follow me on kick we're gonna be streaming on kick more often